to another video. I say good morning, you could be watching this at night, you could be watching it in the morning, whatever time of the day it is, I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. I've just finished getting ready because I'm about to head off to mum and dad's house for like a very chill Mother's Day slash dad's birthday get together. Mum's still not feeling great. She has had to have today off work still and she does have a doctor's appointment later this afternoon. I'm also gonna be taking it Nugget along with me cause she's gonna have a little play date. But I love my outfit today. I've just got my hair cause I just washed it this afternoon just quickly blow dried it. The first day when I blow dry my hair, it's just so like poofy, like I look like Hagrid. So I've just put it out into a side plait. My 411's jumper, my Nike leggings. And I've got my new shoes on. Cute. I love them. And they're actually very comfortable too. But let's bring Nay in and get her ready to go have a play date with you and Zoe. Come on in. I also stayed at Courtney's house, not last night, but the night before. And I realized like, yesterday as I was unpacking that I actually left my spare battery and battery charger for this camera at Courtney's house. So luckily Courtney's going today and I've messaged her again this morning to remind her to bring it. I know, <laughs> but she hasn't responded yet. So hopefully she does remember to bring it because obviously I need that. But I'm gonna pack the car, get Nugget ready to go because I need to get her into her harness. Then see you guys when we get there. I know I do need to pick up a birthday cake as well once I get there because mum's just not feeling well enough to go collect it. So I'll get that probably as soon as I get there because I know mum has a doctor's appointment later this afternoon. But I'm gonna get Nugget ready. I'm gonna get her in the car and go. Picked up the cake. It looks so yummy. It's a tiramisu cake for dad because that's his absolute favorite cake in the world. Looks absolutely incredible and I cannot wait to dig into that. But I just wanted to quickly check in because I don't know how much footage I'll get from tonight purely because mum's not feeling great. Yeah, I don't know if she'll be up to being filmed. So I'll see what, oh, I'll see what little bits and pieces I can get on my phone or whatnot. But yeah, don't expect too much from tonight. <laughs> Hi guys, it is now Monday the 13th of May. Now, I may look a little bit unhinged at the moment, but that's because I am. <laughs> because I've come off night shift this morning. So I'm tired, I need to keep myself awake, need to get myself moving. But I've just had a shower, got into some comfy clothes. I'm rocking my new new... <laughs> My new, new, my new New Balance shoes. And I also bought these new socks because I thought they were really cute. And they're actually very comfortable. But I'm about to head off to meet Reese at a cafe for lunch. He's dropped off his car to the mechanic this morning and he's no joke been walking for like at least four hours straight. I think he's done at least like 25 kilometers already because he's doing like this step challenge at his work where everyone's like competing to try and get the most amount of steps. Don't know what the prize is, I think it's just bragging rights. He's been enjoying that today whilst I've just been chilling, catching up on vlogs on YouTube. But I'm gonna pop this one outside with the dentist stick and then I'm gonna head off to the cafe, which I'm very excited for. Cause all I've had this morning is a coffee and that's it. <laughs> I don't think it's kicked in well enough yet. And I've just finished up at the cafe and oh my gosh, I am so full. It was just so nice to get out as well. It was nice in the sun. It was a little bit chilly, so I'm glad I ended up bringing my jumper. But Reese has already started walking back home, so I'll show sure how long that will take him, but good on him. He's determined to get 30 kilometers today, which is absolutely nuts in my opinion, but he's just so determined to get it done. Also got my car booked in for a service tomorrow, just as like a general service, but my aircon as well in my car is completely stuffed. Just before or just after we came back from Torquay, my car was making a really weird noise, but I kind of just ignored it. Like you ignore most sounds unless my car completely conquers out. You know, if it's running, it's fine. And so it's been very hot in my car recently. And I know it's not summer yet, but I'm gonna need that aircon fix. Cause even when it's not super hot, I still like the aircon on. Like I'm one of those weird people. So let's pray that it's not gonna be super expensive. That's what's happening tomorrow. But I'm, I'll be heading to my parents' house tomorrow cause the mechanic I take my car to is closer to them because he's just the one I trust with it. I don't trust anyone else with it. So I'm gonna be spending the day there with mum cause I'm pretty sure she's still gonna be off sick. She's still not feeling well at all. It's a very, boring week this week. There's not really going to be much going on. 
I also apologize in advance that this vlog might be a little bit disjointed. It might not be, you know, day after day. And it might be days from like this week, some from next week. Unless you want to see more like mundane, basic every days of my life, let me know. Yeah, I'm going to head back home now. Check on Miss Nugget. I've been checking her on the camera. She's been lying in the sun, living her best life. Reese is back from his big walk. And you've done how many steps? 38,000. Uh, That's yeah. crazy. I'll need a fart. 38,300. This is disgusting. <laughs> Nugget, you're next. No. Yeah. We're gonna head down, walk down to the mechanic to pick up Reese's car, and that's gonna be like another seven Ks. And you've done what, nearly 40 kilometers? No, 32, 40? 32 kilometers. 32 kilometers so far. Mm -hmm. But you might end up getting close to 40. Yeah. Big stretch. Like Come on. No let's go. It is now Tuesday the 21st of May. So it's a little bit of time passed since the last clip you would have seen. But I wanted to quickly talk about a couple of things, which I'm very excited for. I realise there's a post that's been chewed at. One, I have a new phone case. And if anyone is a fan of Taylor Swift, there's a Instagram page. It's called Taylor Swift Styled. And I saw that there was a link to the phone case that she uses. And... Of course I had to get it. I'll insert a picture here of what the case looks like from that. And it literally shows the exact case and where to get it. And I may have gotten it. <laughs> so, call me lame. I don't care. The only bad thing is that it doesn't like connect with the magnet to my car holder. Whereas the case to fire case, I had had it like inbuilt into the case. Because my actual phone is, in, is a 13 and it doesn't actually connect with the magnet. Don't know if anyone would notice that that's what it's from, so I wanted to just point it out. And it's also like a cool square shape, which it's kind of odd to get used to, but I kind of like it. Well, I have to show you what she's looking at me like right now. Look at this cutie bunny. I am planning to take her down to the river to have a little run around in a minute. Mm -hmm. Good girl. <laughs> Can you hear that? I swear I don't live in the country country. Like clearly, I mean like a suburban town. Those are some cows in the distance. <laughs> that was very loud. This morning I met up with a girl from work who is a PT as well. And she had kindly like spent like an hour and a half there with me and like went through, you know, how to do my gym routine, went through each of the exercises with me, you know, filmed. Okay. She also filmed parts of it on my phone so that I could remember what it actually was when I go back to do it. So that was really, really helpful, but I'm extremely sore. So I can't even imagine what I'm going to be feeling like in the morning. She recommended having this. It's like a protein water. So it's not a protein shake. So it doesn't like taste like gross like the other protein powders I've tried before. I'm not going to be using it all the time. Only because it's, it wasn't cheap. But it smells really good. But I think I might have this maybe like a couple times a week. Because I'm also trying to have more protein just in my diet. Instead of just having a supplement. But I thought I'd try it out for the first time here. I realized I didn't bring any water. That was silly, wasn't it? Okay, got my water. So it's the brand Nexus, the super protein collagen estrogen flavor, strawberry berry lime. So I'm just gonna put, let's keep it in. I actually really enjoy the taste of that. Not bad. Hey guys, guess what I've just started rewatching. <laughs> Reese will be just shaking his head if he was here and knew what I was starting to rewatch. I think I could safely say I've watched this series through at least two or three times and no matter what, I just love it. It's obviously a little bit cringy and whatever. I'm I'm excited to be rewatching it because I don't know what else to watch at the moment. 
I could probably just go to bed because I'm very tired. But am I going to go to bed? No. This is like one of those comfort shows that I could watch no matter what and just know that I'm going to be comfortable watching it. I'm going to enjoy it. That and Gilmore Girls. I could definitely rewatch Gilmore Girls to be fair. This is one I'm rewatching. <laughs> it's Pretty Little Liars. Ayo. Honestly, it's two reasons I've wanted to start rewatching this. I've been three reasons actually one i've been wanting to rewatch this all the time but reese just makes fun of me two courtney's best friend tamika is rewatching pretty little eyes which gave me the idea that i want to rewatch it again myself but then number three there's a new series on youtube that i've recently discovered with the original actors so jenna and Paige. can't remember their actual names but they host like a podcast on youtube and they're reviewing each episode each week and like running through it like spilling all these like secrets and relating like what was happening in the show what that would be like if that was actually happening in real life and they have like an actual homicide investigator on very interesting can't remember the name of it right now but i'm sure it would come up if you searched it but yeah so that's my plans for this evening is literally just starting to rewatch pretty little lies now i've got this little one lying on my lap and it's already 10.45, so honestly, I could just go to bed. But I'm not going to. I want to at least get through this first episode. And I don't even know how many times I've actually started re-watching this. The amount of times I've seen this first pilot episode is probably a lot. But I feel like I can't just jump to the second episode. I need to start fresh. Ready? <laughs> 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 oh my god. Hey sweetie. You're not the cutest thing ever. She's got the pillow. Oh my god. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> off this video i would do like a little get ready for bed with me slash my nighttime routine and what products i use every single day you've probably seen little bits and pieces in previous videos but i thought i'd show you a little bit more in detail of what i do and i can hear miss nugget coming hi come here hey. i always have to take my jewelry off because i just i don't know i get worried that the water is just gonna affect the shininess or the quality, I don't really know. Then I like to wash my hands because I feel like it's gross if you go to wash your face and you just got grotty hands. I like to splash my face with a little bit of water. And then the face wash that I use at the moment is the CeraVe Hydrating Cleanser. So I use this morning and night. I actually bought the tiniest bottle when I ordered it online, not realizing it was a small one. I've been waiting ever since for it to be on sale at Chemist Warehouse for like the really big giant bottle. And it's just not. It's very weird as well because the cleanser I used to use was a Propera, the acne prone skin foaming wash. And so for years I've been used to a cleanser that foams up. But this one doesn't actually foam up. But I do notice since using it my skin does feel really extra moisturised. I think I'll be down to the fact that it's a hydrating cleanser which would make complete sense. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> well, I'm glad you cannot smell that part because that stinks. The next I kind of mix kind of like two to three different products depending on what I'm feeling. I think tonight I'll do the whole thing. So I kind of mix the Ordinary Multi-Peptide and HA Solution. I mix some of that on my face along with the Ordinary Niacinamide and Zinc Serum. But I'll also mix those two products in with, with the Ordinary Vitamin C Suspension. I've only just recently started using Vitamin C. I don't quite know if I'm using it properly or if this is the best one I could be using. But it's just the one that I've got my hands on so far. So I'm going to go in with the mix of these three products. I kind of just drip them very like tiny dot on my forehead on one on each cheek along with the niacinamide i don't do a full screws i just do the tiniest bit then i go in with just a little bit of the vitamin c because i find that this actually goes a long way and i just spread it all around my face i kind of want to do like a mix of rubbing and dabbing i feel like dabbing is probably a bit more gentle for your skin 
but most of the times I forget. You know, so I like to take some down my neck. Then for my moisturizer, see, this is the big one that I've been trying to get of my cleanser. Look at the size difference. Like, I want a big one of this. But morning and night, this is the moisturizer that I use. I have never had an issue with it. I absolutely love it, it lasts forever. So I just grab a nice good pump of that, whack it along my face, have to put it down your neck, because your neck needs that hydration too. And then rub it in. I also kind of just mush it over my lips. <laughs> use that to keep my lips moisturized instead of always just using lip balm and then i just brush my teeth and i'm already for bed so i'm gonna quickly brush my teeth now but i'm gonna finish up today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it i'm sorry again that it was kind of a little bit chopped up from last week and a little bit from this week kind of just with my with my work schedule it kind of sometimes makes it a little bit difficult for it to be like a full good proper week i think i will start doing more of also just like a day in my life or a couple of days in my life instead of a full week just because i feel like that's just going to flow a bit better and make a little bit more sense but either way i hope you guys enjoyed if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe down below because i'd love to have you around if you don't follow me on my instagram feel free to go follow me over there because i post a little bit more on my stories a little bit more regularly than over here once again thank you guys so much for watching stay safe stay well and i'll see you next time Bye. Don't know what I just did with my hand, and that was a bit weird. <laughs> I was quietly protective of my heart.